douchebags, DB, as it says on the box, have sent me a load of new travel bags, which is really, really kind of them. They've sent two boxes worth of stuff. So let's get opening it. I don't know why I'm turning my head away as if someone's going to jump out at me. Oh, this is something about receiving things in the post. Alright, this absolute monster, which isn't really a monster because this is actually carry-on. I can take this with me on the plane. It's got a little DB tag there. There's the branding. And the best bit. Yeah, so we're just shooting a little sequence. I'm always busy. I'm always busy. Launching a new company requires 24 hour surveillance, 24 hours every day. Never too busy to talk to my girlfriend. Wait, are you reaching out to me for travel packing advice? Yeah, I am. You should do a packing video. Great timing. All right, sounds good. I will. And then you can watch the video, like it, share it, and then pack hey, from there. Do not talk to me like I'm a subscriber. You are? What do you mean? You're not subscribed? Are you filming me right now? Is that what you said it? No, it's just like I'm a bit sad that you're not even subscribed to me. I'm gonna let you guys crack on. Maybe you can call me when you're done. Maybe you are can you subscribe talking? to me. Hey, can I talk to my boyfriend? <laughs> what do you mean? I'm your boyfriend. Come on, come on. Oh, I was gonna say, okay, fine. Bye. Now that we've got through all of the tape, I'm going to sit down because I was getting a bit agitated with the box. There is a lot of stuff. Oh my goodness. A 15 inch proper laptop sleeve. Second thing, I've seen these before. Okay, this is cool. So, douchebags do these things. They call it the CIA and it is a camera insert accessory. So this basically clips on or fits inside a bag. And it looks as though I've got two of them, which is great because I'm taking a lot of gear with me to Bali this year because it's all about filming. All right, so that is the Explorer backpack. This is called, and I'm not just giving this the name for fun, this is called the Big Bastard. This is absolutely massive, bigger than I thought, which is amazing. I'm gonna clip everything together so that it's all in one place. Thank you, douchebags. Hop! That's your rep. <sighs> this year, I wanted to pack slightly more minimalistically. However, when I'm going through all the stuff, I see situations and t-shirts where I'm gonna know that I will want to wear this to go to this place, or I wanna wear this for a photo in this place, or something along those lines. So right now, i put together all my best barley shirts, and when I say barley shirts, I mean just like shirts that have wacky patterns all over them. Love that. A few white t-shirts in there, a couple dark ones as well, and some stuff that I know Tilda's going to want to steal from me. I wasn't actually going to take as many clothes, I was thinking, and then I just found a load of stuff that I really want to wear, like this barley shirt from the pool party that we had when I met Tilda. I kind of want to take that again. So, because you're only allowed one bag also on the carry-on, and I'm going to take... This bag in the carry-on, because it's actually quite deep, you can fit a lot of stuff in there. I'm going to put this, which is going to be like the day-to-day -day exploring backpack, it's actually called the Explorer, inside this bag, because there's going to be a lot of room left in this, because even though I'm taking more than I thought, I'm not taking that much. And when we're in Bali, we're not just going to be staying in one place, so I'm going to have somewhere I can store this bag, so that when I go on mini adventures and when I'm just going away for a couple of days, I can just take this as opposed to lugging everything around with me because it's easier to get around on bikes than anything else in Bali and carrying this guy on a bike would be a nightmare. It is 13 kilos. Squish that in like that, bendy bendy. <laughs> one of these outside and one nicely in. Let's start filling this up with a few more stickers. Boom, that is in there. Alright, this is starting to look decent. This is going to be a perfect size 
travel carry-on bag. We've got an extender here, which is gonna fit into the other camera insert bag. GoPro, tripod heads, GoPros, card readers and card holders in here. Brainstorms. As Mr. Beast said on Logan Paul's podcast, brainstorm for an hour a day. Okay. So this is my carry on. And then I can attach the other one to the front. Inside pretty much any camera bag is that they are removable. So for example, if you see these nine little squares, doesn't fit in a 5D Mark IV with a 24 to 70 on it. So what you want to do as you've got enough padding here is you want to remove little bits of it Lawrence and I are very fortunate with the camera gear that we're taking with us that we've got like a Sony bag and a Canon bag this is the Canon bag we're going to be shooting a mixture of stuff this is like my photography camera mainly we're going to be shooting a lot of video on here as well and then this one is going to be the Sony bag so as Lawrence and I are launching our company together we have got a lot more gear now so it's like not just mine that i've had for a few years now but it's also lawrence's too so when we add it all together when we get to bali it's going to look a little mental hazard hello mate oh just had a phone call um that was our keys to success it's that way Whew. all right we're on yeah, boom town let's go Masters have arrived at Terminal Catro. Boom. All right, we made it to the airport on time. Plenty of luggage. This has suddenly got a little bit heavier because I said I'd shoot some photos for my friend Aaron's hair products in Bali. So this bag is full of hair products now, as well as all my clothes, tripods, shoes. And I can't find my flip flops, which is going to be quite necessary as we're going to be in Southeast Asia. For probably the next two months, it's looking as though I'm not going to be back in London now until the middle of May. Now that we don't have the apartment in London, it's back to travelling full time. This is literally my life now, what is in these bags here for the foreseeable future. I'm excited to get back on the road again. I'm excited to not just travel to places like Bali where I've been multiple times before. The reason for going to Bali is because I've got an online course to film, which I will be giving out to you guys and selling to you guys over the next few months and I've been really passionate about that so consolidate the start of work and then we're going to start going to some new countries that I've not been to before. This year, I'm going to say this now, I want to visit at least 15 more countries that I've never been to before which would take me over 50 by the end of the year. That's the goal. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like and thank you to Douchebags for sending me all of this stuff. I will see you on the plane to Qatar.